What's going on YouTube? Effect Records here. Today I'm bringing you a video on how to install XBMC dashboard onto your soft modded Xbox. Um, the first thing here we want to do is make sure you have enough space on the E drive. Um, so unfortunately a lot of that means if you have the stock hard drive, um, you're going to have to delete your emulators and uh, your installed games um, to clear up some room for um, for the installation because I tried it because um, I wasn't even thinking about the memory and I tried it and it said it went through it said finished and then when I went to restart my Xbox um, which is part of the step it said fatal error and I had to re-soft mod my Xbox and I thought I broke it at first and then luckily I just had to re-soft mod it and then it went um, I tried it soft mod it the first time and it didn't go through and then um, I formatted the drives and then prepared them and then it went through so um, yeah definitely make sure you have enough memory um, so that there's no not going to be any conflicts during the installation process um, but anyway what you're going to want to do is you're going to download the link down in the description below it is auto installer deluxe um, once you download that just go ahead and burn it to a DVD um, so it's going to be an ISO font uh, file that you're going to burn to a DVD and then once that's done um, here I have my copy right here um, auto installer deluxe um, then once that's done go ahead and uh, open up the drive and stick it in and close it you can also put it in and when you start it up and it should read it and I go to launch DVD um, the loading time is um, usually takes a while so just bear in mind it's gonna take a while to load up um, but when I had that fatal error I actually used this CD um, to uh, soft, re soft mod my Xbox because it has the soft mod um, into it so it was it was kind of nice because um, I didn't have to go out and get you know my uh, my 007 game again and re soft mod it that way I just re uh, use this CD to uh, soft mod it um, so yeah just let it load oh there it goes um, auto installer deluxe and once you reset screen just uh, scroll down till you get to uh, dashboard selection and go ahead and hit A and then um, if you're using a chip go to install E drive but if it's a soft mod go down here to install E drive um, under soft mod selection and go ahead and hit A and this is where you're going to go down to the Xbox Media Center XBMC to install that dashboard go ahead and hit A um, if you're using just the uh, retail hard drive the stock one just go ahead and hit the first one um or if you're using a bigger one you can go ahead and hit the last two but i'm going to go ahead and hit retail and then uh this is going to go through the installation process on extracting and uh, installing it onto the xbox for the new dashboard Which I like the XBMC dashboard a lot better than the uh, than the Unleashed X, but I like the Unleashed X better than the, than the Evo. So, but everybody has their different opinions. I just think the XBMC looks a lot cleaner, in my opinion, and it looks more professional. Yeah, I plan to. Uh, um, actually sell these modded Xboxes so if you're interested let me know and I'll sell you one um, cuz I'm gonna keep one for myself obviously with um, I'm gonna try to get like every movie every uh, music all my music and uh, all my favorite games and every game for emulators and all that stuff um, installed directly to the Xbox I'm gonna get like a one terabyte hard drive for it it's gonna be dope. I already ordered a five uh, five hundred gigabyte hard drive, so when that comes in, um, I'm gonna make another video on how to upgrade the hard drive on the original Xbox. Um, so I'm just waiting for 
my new hard drive to come in the mail. It should come in sometime early next week. That's the plan anyway. Yeah, when I did this the first time, um, when I didn't have enough memory, it got to like 28%, and then it just like skipped the rest, and then it started flashing, but then it said finished, so I was like, alright, cool, and then I hit A, and it said restart the Xbox, so I restarted it, and then it came up with like this fatal error zero code or something like that, so I was like, crap, that sucks, <laughs> and uh, I thought I had broke it, um, and then uh, I was like, that sucks. Because I didn't have enough memory on it. Wasn't even thinking about that. Um, so then I went back through. And uh, deleted um, all my, my emulators. And all the games. Um, and then tried it again. It said finished. But it actually went through to 100%. Um, but it still didn't work. And then I had to soft model it again, but it goes finish. So hit back the back button or B, I guess, um, until you get to this menu. Then go ahead and click restart Xbox. And then if everything goes as well, XBMC. Now you got the XBMC dashboard on your original Xbox. Um, so if you like this video, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, again, the uh, Auto Installer Deluxe link will be down in the description below. Um, it's going to be on like uh, the XboxISO.com or something like that. Um, yeah, just give me a thumbs up. Uh, have a good one. Yep, peace.